Wow! Are you kidding me? Hey, everyone, what's going on? My name is Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play um, Pokemon Crystal. That was the first Pokeball I threw at Snor Snorlax. Um, I was also in a recording session. I forgot that this was even what I was doing right now. This Pokemon's stomach is so strong, even eating mold or rotten food will not affect it. That is beautiful. Uh, I will name him, um, um, I, you, my cat's playing with a toy in the background. Hopefully you can't hear that. But, holy yo. A very loose, oh, I could have, dang, I could have had a space in there. I didn't think it would fit. <sighs> Ticklet's key. Are you gonna react to the fact that I killed the Snorlax? You started collect Kanto Jam badges. Don't you agree that the trainers here are tough? Girl, that damn tough. So, that Snorlax kicked my butt. I put him to sleep immediately. He immediately woke up. Almost killed my, uh, uh, my Mr. Weagles. This was the first time I recorded in a long time, uh, as well. Oh god, sorry. I'm a little really, really burpy. Yeah, but that was the first Pokemon I threw at him. I can't believe it, man. After all that. <sighs> well, I guess that's just a cool show uh, what happens when you prepare a little baby bit. Anyways, what uh, what do we have to do still? Um, we're Pokegear. Pokegear. I know we gotta go to like... Oh, I guess we can go through Diglett's Cave since we just unlocked that. There we go. I'm not even sure where this leads. I don't remember. Oh, shit. Well, I guess it's not a big cave, is it? I was gonna say shot repels, but I guess I don't need to. I still just cut myself off. You'd think maybe I would stop doing that. Oh, don't need flash. A bunch of diglets. Uh don't know, that was shocking. <laughs> I like how he's acting like this is new new news. That's pretty much what he said in the last game too, if I remember correctly. Diglet! I highly considered having a diglet on my team. Level three? Jeez man. I highly considered having a diglet on my team, and then I found out this is the first time I'm pretty sure you encounter a a, a catchable diglet. So, oh, day I totally thought I was gonna get a pickleball there. Yeah, I'm not gonna waste repels just simply because this place is really short to get through. And hold on, I'm gonna, this is gonna be a disturbance in the force. Uh, okay, my mic was touching my desk, so I had to move. There's also dug trios in here, but they're pretty rare to find. I mean, they're not super rare. Oh, damn it! I don't want to waste repels because this is a super short key. We're already more than halfway done. Hit a ooh, look at that little twenty flea. I'm pretty sure uh, dug trios are a level. 31 or something like that if I remember correctly. At least they were in Pokemon Yellow. I don't really know. Oh, dang it. What's in that rock? I must know. I must waste the step. I must waste. There we go. Level 31, level 32. Somewhere in that area. And, oh, 20. Wow. I was very wrong. I would catch them, but I don't know. It's fine. I guess. Aha. A max revive. Wow. Holy crap, man. Can't buy damn dares anywheres. Oh, good lord, they're like the Zubats, except they're actually kind of decent Pokemon, I think. I mean, I don't know anything about Potemu, so... Blah, 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 blah. Get out of here! Alright, there we go, and... Oh. <laughs> Diglett's Revenge! He's like, remember me? Yeah, I'm not letting you out that easily! Alright. Should we just kill us one? Sure, just kill us one. After everything we've been through, we have to kill one of these guys. I mean, faint him. How can I be so ridiculous? I thought they would just fall down like that. They just fall beneath my name text things there when you when you hit them. Out two. Where are we? What? This is like cave music, isn't it? Oh, no, I got all happy. What level are you? Level 57? Okay. Never mind. I was going to say, since I switched Mr. Wiggles up, I figured I could train... I figured you had already been trained. Oh, wow. I don't think we've been to Pewter City. Yeah, we haven't been to any of these left cities, so maybe we'll go to Pewter first. Pew, pew. No, not what I want to do. Ding, ding, ding. This is like the first... Uh-oh. Okay, good. I still do have something I can cut. I was very unsure about that, so we want to go north then. Ooh, is this, is this the Mr. Mime house? I don't know if it'll still be that or not, but I think this might be where you could get Mr. Mime in the original game. Let's see. Hi, wow, I'm glad to see you. You're the first person I've had in a long time. I'm super happy. Let me give you a little present. Ooh, well, that was random. <laughs> he gave me a poop nuggets. Gross. That's a nugget. I can't give you any nuggets of wisdom, so they'll have to do. 
Okay, so I guess I'll never know since I'm assuming, even if it was, I'm assuming it's just a different NPC since you know stuff and things and reasons. He's just so happy, I like it. I don't think I want to go down there yet. Let's go up. Let's go to Pewter first. Pew pew! <laughs> uh, oh, dang, I think I already went that way. Ugh, I just don't want to miss a dang thing. It's a branch in the road, you guys. Which way shall we go? We shall go this way. I've already decided. Shall I? Oh, oh yeah, trainers. That's a thing. If you walk in tall grass, wearing shorts, do you get nicks and cuts? Yeah, you can. Rashes. And it really, uh, no, it is, re is really annoying sometimes. But catch your head. Beat drill. Hmm. Woo. Um, Game Grum's favorite Pokemon. You guys look really cool, though. You'd think you would be better. I really wish, like, Bug Pokemon were better. <laughs> There should be, I don't know, maybe there is, like, better bug Pokemon as the generations go on. But I just know, like, bug Pokemon always, like... Actually, I didn't even say it in these games. They're really good, like, at the beginning of the game, and then they get really crap. But then again, I don't even think they're really good at the beginning of the game, either. Like, they evolve quickly, but it's still, like... I don't know, they're not good enough to really, like, warrant ever having. So it's like, why waste your time training this when you can train, like, a Nidoran? Or, like, your starter? Or probably any other Pokemon you can get near the beginning of the game? I don't know. It's like you always gotta think long term, you know. Give me a lot of XPs. <gasps> oh no, I don't have the amulet coin. I think that's probably fine at this point. I don't think we're gonna need money for anything else. I hope. Perhaps I'm incorrect in that. Perhaps that's a silly thing to think about, but what I think about, but maybe perhaps that's a silly thing to not worry about, because maybe I do need money. Don't know. You never have enough mon mon hun hun. Alright. Ouch, ouch, ouch! Yeah, you suck, bug catcher. They'll they'll really sting when you take a bath. No, they sure will. Let's see what's in here. Let's, let's do one pay to mon battle. One pay to mon battle. Okay, I'm glad I got a Pokemon battle on the other edge of the grass. Oh, Pikachu! Oh, nice. Didn't see that one coming. Oh, we can't hurt the Pikachu. Hmm. That's weird, I'm pretty sure- yeah, you can definitely can't just randomly catch Pikachu like that in first gen, so it's weird. Welcome to Pewter City, pew pew, ha <laughs> I keep saying that, it's really annoying. A stone gray city, <laughs> those signs no longer make any sense. <laughs> There's a notice here. Mount Moon gift shop now open- ooh, oh wait, you can go to the Mount Moon? Oh man, perhaps we should have not came here yet, did I talk to this guy? Oh, you came all the way out here from Johto? That brings back memories. When I was young, I went to Johto to train. You remind me so much what I was like as a young man. Here, I want you to have this item. Uh, I found Johto. Silver wing? Is that, is that for bird pigeoning? Oh! You just have to get ho ho Oh, ho ho <laughs> Hmm, but I'm pretty sure you need another item. Get around. Shake! They're just teaching his Pokemon. Some tricks and moves and stuff. Get on that bike. Get on that bike! The fruit bearing tree hates hey, a mint berry. Okay. I really want one of those golden fruit berries. I wonder if those are you can get some normal berry trees. And perhaps there's just like a there's like a rare chance you get it or something. Oh. Well, we look like a trainer. We've been visit the Peter's gym. The leader uses rock type Pokemon. That is good to know. Thanks, girl. You the bomb. Dot com. <laughs> Hello. Hi, to all my Gyarados. I raised it from Magikarp. I can't believe how strong it has become. Yeah, Gyarados is pretty cool. Uh, totally Pokemon I'd have, but I didn't use it in my last one. There was once a weird old man who sold Magikarp. He was saying that the Magikarp from the Lake Rage were excellent. Really? Huh. I bet that's actually true. What was that? The cat's doing something. I heard some fall. That doesn't bode well. He's a mischief maker. Well, there's a nose here. Pewter Museum of Science is closed for renovate. Okay, <clears throat> for renovations. That's good then. Does it say it shouldn't just close a museum? That's not very nice. Okay, we don't want to design this for this game. Brock, oh yeah. The Rock Solid Pokemon Trainer, the first trainer of Gen 1. Let's, uh... Toss egg. 
What the hell? He swayed g g g g g <laughs> Oh, he's on level 56! Really? Wow, that's actually pretty crazy to me. Uh, yo, champ of the bacon! You're really rocking, are you battling the gym leaders of Kanto? They're strong and dedicated people, just like Jodo's gym leaders. Okay, we do have some trainers here. I'm assuming they're gonna be, all be super easy as they have been. But I would honestly not be too shocked if they threw me a screwball at some point and just out of nowhere, like, give me free, like, level 70 Pokemon to fight. Maybe that's a little crazy, but, like, level 60, you know, something on par. The trainers of this gym use Rock-type Pokemon. The Rock-type has a high defense. Battles could end up going a long time. Are you ready for this? Like, uh, the, the trainers, you know, it's just this guy and Brock. <laughs> the other guys got- wait, was it just one camera trainer? Oh, God. Science, okay, that's not bad. I, I think I've considered having Science Slash before as well, but I don't think he's very good, maybe? I don't know, something like that. Once again, I hate having these HM moves. I really wish I could get rid of them. But alas, I could do no such thing. And deaded. 10, 10 out of 10 dead. 200 health, that's crazy, man. I have to win these battles, no. What level was that even? I didn't even really look. Hey you, trainer from Johto, Brock is tough. He'll punish you. Don't take him seriously. Wow, sounds spoopy. Well, it's not often that we get a challenger from Johto. I'm Brock the Pewter Gym Leader. I'm an expert on rock type Pokemon. My Pokemon are uh, impervious to most physical attacks. You'll have a hard time inflicting any damage. Come out! I am talking to you, so come on. I wonder what his sprite looks like. Oh, he look, he's like kind of chilled out, I guess. He has like a... Hey, he doesn't have like his like traveling gear on. What level are you? 50? Oh, 41. <laughs> so 56! Nope. Not even close. 15 levels off, to be exact. And it. So we're just gonna surf spam everything. Oh, man, that's... Well... Well, I guess we do have five Hydro Pump uses. I'm more, more or less looking for just short animation. <laughs> I don't know if Hydro Pump will be short or not, but maybe. What, what, you, what was that? Kabutops. Oh! You're a bug, are you not? Is it Rock Bug? So I should do normal damage, and which actually is a good idea to use Hydro Pump. Mm -mm -mm. So I really gotta blow my nose. So I'm gonna quickly mute my mic so you guys don't have to hear that disgustingness. And we'll continue the battle. Jeez, man, three Kleenexes later. Rhyhorn, oh nice, that's a nice. Wait, that's his last one, right? Jeez, that, I have a lot up there, man. It's disgusting. Disgusting with that. I'm trying. How was he doing? I think he has one more after this, actually. Ryan's a really cool Pokemon, too. I really wanted to get, actually, um, I really wanted to get a uh, uh, fan fee for this playthrough, but check a card I had, and I'm like, well, I don't know. I don't wanna, you know, be too copycatted to tell you. Good job, Onyx. Good job. Proud of you. Very proud. So let's finish him off with a surf. Just to laugh at his face. Get out of here, Rockworm! Does Onyx ever get any evolutions? He's just kinda there, you know? See, I feel like if a Pokemon doesn't get evolutions, it's kinda like, well, what's the point? Your Pokemon's powerful attacks overcame my rock hard defense. <laughs> Stronger than I expect. Go ahead, take this page. Uh, Chris is in the big debate. The Boulder Dash. Chris, thanks. I enjoy battling you, even though I am a bit upset. <laughs> the Boulder Badge will make your, uh, your Pokemon even more painful. Yay, we did it! Oh, dang. How many more gyms do we have? I'm not even sure. Was it six? Was that six of eight? I don't know. I'll have to look at my previous titles to figure something out there. Was there? Is there a Poké Center here? I don't think there is. Is there? She used a little, a little doggy. Okay, that's weird. You think the first, the area of the first gym would have a, would have a uh, Poké Center? 
Eh, I guess it doesn't, unless I'm just missing it, which is very possible, but I don't want to spend too much time here. So let's head to, oh, jeez, okay. Let's head to Route 3. Hmm, I don't know what to do. Oh, no, about what? Let me help you decide your plight, young sir, ma'am. Also, I'm not entirely sure why I'm still showing these battles, Warren. After this one, I'll start cutting till the end of the episode, unless, you know, something interesting happens. Well, let's face it, we're probably too far in the game for anything, like, new to show up, you know? <laughs> Hit this bird with a wave! I'm sure that will end very nicely. <clears throat> yeah, dead. Dead Fred. Yay! Youngster Warren was defeated. I knew I'd lose. Oh, that's that's some good hope to have. <clears throat> you look strong. I was afraid to take you on. No, I just realized I didn't use my coin on uh, my amulet coin on Brock. I probably should have done that at least. Well, it circles around you. I can run like the wind, bullseye. Uh, Radicate and Orbok. Youngster Jimmy. Blown away. <laughs> Sorry. I wear shorts <laughs> the whole year round. That's my fashion policy. Beautiful. I find that fascinating. Absolutely fascinating. What's down here? I do not know. I do not know. Anything? No, I guess not. That's weird. Anyway, I'm sure there's like trainers or something down there in the last game. Whoa, uh, I need to look in that grass. See what's there. Ah, the weather's as fine as ever. Uh, yeah, if only it rained in this game. Two Magmars and a Wheezy. Fire Breather Otis. It's sunny, but I'm all wet. Wow, that's actually pretty fitting considering I the Pokemon is easier. When it rains, it's hard to get ignition. Oh, yeah, it sure is. It sure is. What we got? What we got, mate? We got, we got a Spiro. Alright, so there's, okay, there's nothing here. There's nothing interesting. I mean, there might be, but. I'll, I'll just do, like, I'll, I'll battle one random Pokemon per, like, new root grass ring. Mount Moon Square. Let's go up to the stairs. What? Oh, you're a trainer. Jeez, I didn't expect that. Step right up and take a look. I don't know why I didn't expect it. I probably should have. Have you seen Slugma? I don't think you've seen Slugma. I'm pretty sure this is a pre-evolution to Megmar. I think. Maybe? I'm not entirely sure. Anyways, he's dead. I got the kind of show you guys. I didn't even say anything to him. Fire breather Burt. <laughs> oh, I thought it said Burt for a second. Yeah, well, that's hot. Shoo! Uh, the greatest fire breather in Kanto. That's me. But not the best trainer. Womp womp. Interesting title you've given yourself, sir. <gasps> what? It's been a while, Chris. Since I lost to you, I thought, oh no, about what I was lacking with my Pokemon. And we've come up with an answer, Chris. Now we'll say, well, come on, man! Are you serious? How in the world was I supposed to know this was coming? I thought we were done with you, Salmon. Oh no, what level are you gonna be? Uh, we need to look up, oh, we're level 40. Wow, really? Hold on, we're looking up types here. Uh, actually, we could probably just take this guy on. Look at, no, I'm trying to click the image, but it's not working. Um, no, oh, God damn it. This chart is not working how it normally does. Uh, dark. Yeah, the dark. Uh, oh, water sucks against it. Actually, oh, that's dragon I'm looking at. <laughs> no, where's dark? Wait, is that dragon or dark? Oh, that's, no, there we go, dark. <laughs> Fighting is effective against it. Um, but I'll use effect. That's weird. Just because, well, I don't know. Ghost is bad. Fairy's bad. Okay, so we could use water. But ours, Hydro Pump will go. Oh, 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 or Surf. <laughs> That's what I meant to do. Alright. I scared myself for a second. I thought I wasn't recording. <laughs> okay. What do you have next for me, sir? Kind sir. Uh, it's about to use Golbat. Flying type. Flying electrics. Oh, I don't have. No, I don't have Deaf Mammal. Oh man, I miss Deaf Mammal. Um, anything else is good against some electric ice? Don't have that. Rock do not have that. All right, let's throw in Mr. Wiggles. Just gonna throw in Ernest for a second. Like, well, it's probably a bad idea because most of his move, or I guess earthquakes, you know, that wouldn't affect him at all. But still, Bristle wouldn't really do a whole lot of good. I don't remember what the other two were. Alright, no, I was gonna say, wait, this probably won't be effective against him, but never mind, he's not a psychic. He just has confusing moves. Oh, wow. Oh, that's super effective! Really? Psychic super effective on his flying? Oh, that's a magneton. 
Is Steel type in this game yet? I don't, is it? I don't know if it counts as a Steel type not or yet. Or what? Or whoa! Well, it says fire super effective against it. I do have Conroy, right? Okay, I do. So let's let's test that out. I don't know if is, is Steel a part of this generation yet, or did that not come till later? Because Dark type is part of this. I feel like Steel didn't come till next generation, until Gen three. But uh, let's see. This is super effective then, unless because the only th other thing would be is normal, right? Okay, so that probably means Steel is a part of this game. Yes, <laughs> I don't know. About to use, oh, Thrall of the Gator. Yeah. Uh, water. The uh, fire sucks. Water will obviously suck. Electric, grass. Those are good, and that's really it. So let's throw some Uranus in here, shall we? Let's throw Stop in here and see what he can do. To be fair, our for Alligator is the most intimidating of Gen 2 Pokemon, I think. Let's, oh yeah, Chikorita's uh, whenever the evolution for him. All right, let's do an Earthquake. Make your ass do away with an Earthquake. Sorry. Oh no, scary face. Wow, what a waste of mood. Let's just use a normal horn attack. I don't know why I did that. I should have at least used Mega Horn. <laughs> hey, it killed him still. I honestly didn't see that one coming. Did not see that one coming. Gengar. Ghost. Psychic. Right, that one I didn't have to look up. I was starting to, but I'm like, oh yeah, it's Psychic. Grrr, look, he looks like he's just like thumbs down. I don't know why he has a, like extra animation of like his legs and tail jiggling around. Weird. So like the animation for that looked is fine. I'm, look, part of me is a little disappointed that even this battle's super easy. Like, why are they only level 43 is worse than I guess. I guess that's kind of the bad thing. It's like the Elite Four. I guess they kind of have to be the most powerful, but you know, it kind of makes the rest of the game not boring but unfulfilling. I guess. Uh, crap. What, let's throw Naraka. I'm pretty sure Naraka's the only one that hasn't fought anyone yet. But wait a minute, is he super effective? No. So I think we're good. I guess fly. Fly! Good job. I feel like that's going to be super effective against people. Well, my psychic was super offensive against Zubat, or uh, Golbat, I mean. So. There we go. Look at that. Everyone got everyone got a play here. So they use the ammo at some point. I think it's actually Naraku that has a visit. it. I thought I raised my Pokemon to be the best they could be. And it still wasn't enough. Yeah, it's because I'm only level. Whoa! 9,000 Poké Dollars? You won fair and square. I admit it. But this isn't the end. Oh, I'm going to be the greatest Pokemon trainer ever. Because these guys are behind me. Listen, Chris. One of these days, I'm going to prove how good I am by besting you. Oh, alright. Um, thank you all very much for watching. If you enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving a like. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. The next one, we'll explore Mount Moon. Um, I hate caves. <laughs> Too many Zubats, even with the repels, man. Uh, so yeah, I hope to see you guys next time. So long, so long, Gabe Bowser.